You know what the best thing about weather like this is or about a thunderstorm in general is that you can go for a run. You can just blast some music and just run in this rain. And that's exactly what I'm gonna do. I kind of have to hurry up because I want to get out there before the rain stops. But I can't go hard without actually warming up first because otherwise, you know, that just doesn't work. So I'm gonna warm up in here for like five minutes and then go out and just go at it. But I just wanna blast some music and run as hard as I can in the rain because to be honest, there's nothing better than that. The cool thing about the Apple Weather app is that they give you a little like storm. There it is in the app, which is pretty cool. I warmed up for a bit, got my heart rate up. You're gonna see me after the run because I'm not gonna take my camera outside. But yeah, I'm really excited. See you later. <laughs> <laughs> that was absolutely insane. It was so nice. All right, I'm going to quickly shower. Officially post exam season, but I decided to not write to the exams because I think I could have maybe scraped by a pass just about. But I'd rather learn the content properly. I guess I just mismanaged my time throughout that quarter, especially due to the small rocket project and the launch. So I'm gonna stay here for another two weeks. Well, I'm gonna stay here for another couple of days, then I'm going to Paris for the weekend. So the exams I did write were the second part of electromagnetism, the Calculus 2 reset, and ATSI. I already know I passed ATSI, so that's great, because that was the one where it was a bit iffy, and I'm still waiting on the results for the Calculus 2 and electromagnetism. Although, I know I was already passed electromagnetism, because they released the results straight after, but not the grades. So actually only waiting on Calculus 2, which was the hardest one. And I still have to write Python and Linear Algebra. And the cool thing is, while I'm here for the next two weeks, I have lots of time on my hands. So besides <laughs> meeting with friends, I can take sports more seriously, which is great. I can work on some YouTube stuff and I can properly study for Python and Linear Algebra. It's already five o'clock now because uh, this morning I went to campus for an ATSI review just to see where I made my mistakes. So yeah, Right now, I'm gonna work a bit on linear algebra and then maybe a bit on Python uh, and then on a YouTube video. And I'm actually looking forward to the next couple of weeks because I have zero distractions in terms of I can just work all day, but in a healthy way, of course, so I can just take my breaks and everything's relaxed. And it's kind of nice because now I'm studying because I want to, not because I have to, or I, I do have to because I have to pass this course in order to get my degree. But it's not like I'm, I'm studying this in order to pass an exam, it's more like I'm studying this because I want to. Man, I sound like a nerd. But anyway, <laughs> I'm gonna get started on some linear algebra. Alright, well, <laughs> I'm really tired, probably because of the hard run earlier. Also, one more thing, one good thing about being here is that I have access to a gym, which I don't do at home, or like a proper gym. But yeah, I'm really tired, so I'm gonna edit for an hour or so, and then I'm off to meet the OA committee members for the Beach Volleyball Association, because we're organizing what shot, so the Beach Volleyball Association is doing during the opening week, and now we have like a social evening hangout thing, where we're gonna go to someone's place and have dinner and chill for a bit, but we really have to get into some work first. Alright, I got a bit of editing in. This is gonna take a while. I mean, the original footage is like 36 minutes and I'm trying to get it down to 15. This is a video of how much I spent for my first year university. Hopefully it helps out some people who are going to start university and see how much it costs to live here in the Netherlands, or specifically in Delft. Now I'm off to my friend's place to have dinner over there. And that's it for me. You'll hopefully see a bit more of me in the summer because I simply have more time on my hands, but at the very least, once a week. And I hope you have a great rest of your day and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. 
Okay, hi, right, it's time I was just editing. It's Tuesday the 28th of June and the Calculus 2 grades are out, so I failed the first time. Like 75% of the whole year did as well. And now the reset grades are out and I had a good feeling after and I'm gonna check right now. So I need 58% to pass. Oh. Thank God. <laughs> oh, no way. I guess really studying your ass off doesn't pay off in the end. What the f? Subscribe to Hustle Max right now. Right now. Yeah, right, right now. The red button and the. Right now. Below. Below. And leave a like and comment. Like yes. and comment, guys. Comment, comment yeah.